We are looking up to 3,000 participants from Fiji's key source markets, staying throughout Nandi and the coral coast regions. Directly in terms of direct economic benefit, the event organizers using its model forecast total revenue of approximately $12 million per annum without multiplier. This includes an estimated 1.2 million in spend by the event organizers and 10.8 million in particular spend, in participant spend. Now if you take a very basic calculation based on an estimated 3,000 participants, staying at least four nights, we are looking at approximate return on investment of $9.3 million. This looks at departure tax, accommodation, food and beverage, transport and airfare, and this is without applying any multiplier. On media value, as I mentioned, the event has been forecasted on quarter one, media value of $2.750 million. Fiji will be the exclusive trifecta location for Australia, New Zealand and the Pacific, so great marketing exposure for the Fiji brand. Like other major events, the event will be showcased through strategic television advertising, broadcast, social media campaigns, and etc. Indirectly, local suppliers and communities will be engaged in construction, catering, apparel, electronics, transport, and entertainment. The event will look at various locations such as Embedded so that we spread the benefits and exposure. Mr. Speaker said the Ministry will continue to work with its partner organizers through the study committee to ensure that the event delivers maximum exposure and benefits for Fiji. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir. Thank you, Honourable Minister. Supplementary question? <coughs> Thank you, uh, Honourable Speaker. Speaker. Uh, my question is kind of twofold, and I'm not sure if you're going to allow it, sir, but uh, firstly, how much is the input from the Fijian government with respect to this particular event? How much are we putting in? And secondly, uh, I didn't quite catch what the marketing dollars uh, gain in this is going to be. No. <coughs> Honourable Speaker, our contribution to this is $750,000 a year for three years. Um, and um, you look at the return on investment on that one, Honourable Speaker, uh, you're talking about $10, $12 million uh, in actual spend, not, not, not taking into account the not taking into account the multiplier. The multiplier, honorable speaker, is the way it multiplies in the economy. So dollars to dollar, uh, $750,000 for $12, 12, 12 million dollars return uh, in direct uh, receipts, uh, honorable speaker. The other question was the marketing plan. Honorable speaker, The marketing spend, honorable speaker, is uh, can, can I share this with the minister, uh, with, with the uh, with the member a little later on? It's, it's here somewhere, honorable speaker. I don't want to. Oh, the media value, my speaker, is 2.7 million dollars on the first quarter alone. 2.7. Two seven five zero million. Two point two point seven million dollars on the back of this bank. Thank you. Yeah. Honorable Leader of Opposition. Thank you, sir. Uh, just a quick uh, supplementary question to the Honorable Deputy Prime Minister. Uh, what sort of uh, numbers are we looking at? Uh, although I'm aware of uh, what will be online in terms of viewers and but how many people are we expecting, roughly, uh, on our shores? Uh, the, many, the only reason why I'm asking this is because of uh, room capacity. And given the influx of uh, tourists and whatever into the country, because this is one of our constraints as well when it comes to hosting uh, major events. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Um, as I've highlighted, Honorable Speaker, it's going to be November. November is one of our low months for Fiji. And the, uh, and the whole of Nandi and the Coral Coast will be accommodating these 3,000 people. And there will be people who, uh, who, who stay in the five-star resorts, and there are those who stay in backpackers. 
Nandi, General Nandi, the Nandi Airport and Varan, the Coral Coast have a range of accommodation to accommodate these 3,000 people during this period. So, in terms of accommodation, Honorable Speaker, we, we can cater to, to, uh, to these kind of numbers.